technology. You give a presentation that, and you, you wrote this uh, Spanish proverb, which is something along the lines of the, the dilemma of a of two horns is the same bowl or, so, or something along those lines, mm -hmm. which is this idea that for some reason humans are not very good at at these nuanced topics. Like for instance, in your research, you know, it's not nurture versus, versus nature. It's both it's the same thing you were, you were saying about like in, in, in many fields, like in physics, for instance, it's like quantum mechanics versus like general relativity. And like, oh, there's always like this yes or no. Why do you think humans are always thinking yes or no, while we see in many experiments that it, it seems to be like in science is oftentimes just both or neither or whatever. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah. So the horns of a of the dilemma are on the same bowl. Okay. Thank yeah. you. And um, you know, it's 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 an interesting question. I can only speculate. I, I think um, we humans strive for certainty, um, for crisp thinking, for classifying and for comparing and drawing conclusions. And so it's very, uh, it's, that's a very useful process to be able to, to do that. At the same time, it's important to realize when that kind of approach is not what's needed for a problem at hand. And, um, and then respond in a more nuanced way. So certainly nature nurture is, is that, and it's really, Genomics that um, gave us those insights. Prior to genomics, the way we thought about nature and nurture was genes or the environment. Sounds like apples and oranges. Sounds like it's either biology um, or it's stuff from the outside. But one of the first major insights of genomics um, is that the environment affects the genome. So heredity affects the genome and the environment affects the genome. So we showed this with, with honeybees in one of the early experiments in the subfield of behavioral genomics. And so um, when you see that, um, then you have to develop a more nuanced perspective. And the nuanced perspective with respect to nature nurture is that um, there are hereditary effects on behavior and there are environmental effects on behavior and they both act via the genome. Hereditary effects are longer term from generation to generation and they affect uh, primarily the uh, sequence of DNA. So there can be mutations, changes in the DNA. Environmental effects uh, on the genome occur by influencing which genes are turned on and which genes are turned off. And so you have actions um, on both levels that explain um, how to look at nature and nurture um, in a more nuanced way. So you can't say, oh, it's either genes or the environment. It's genes acting over longer periods of time, longer time scales, or genes acting on shorter time scales.